science is uh, trying to catch up with God. Mm. So they're still doing things, uh, trying to catch up with the knowledge that God already knows. Ask the pastor. Is stem cell research biblical? As believers, we don't believe in murdering or thou shalt not kill is one of the commandments. And I don't, we should not believe in abortion. So I believe that if these stem cells are coming from aborted or fetal material, um, that would definitely be sinful and something that we don't want to be involved in. Um, here again, there's, there's so many things that can be cured um, from that type of research, but we just have to be careful where these stem cells are coming from um, before we can, you know, rely on that type of research. Science is uh, trying to catch up with God. Mm. So they're still doing things, uh, trying to catch up with the knowledge that God already knows. Right. Mm -hmm. I think we can do better by uh, just getting in faith and just believing God and just allow God to be God mm. instead of us trying to be God yes. and, and, and trying on. to be the, and I, and I don't knock science completely, but we can get in the place where we think that we're God. And so mm. we have to stay in our place that God is the one he made us yes. and not we ourselves. Come on. We are the sheep of his pasture and we have to keep that mentality. And if we have that mentality, then stem cell research won't even be an issue. God is not anti-science. God created science. Mm. God created the earth. And um, there's something in doing research that really helps us understand God on a deeper level. And so certainly I don't think it's necessarily wrong to engage in various types of research. However, um, it's okay to do those research insofar as it doesn't compromise clear biblical teachings. Mm. And so as was said earlier, um, yeah. if you're getting sales from aborted babies or if you're getting it in an unethical way, um, God will certainly condemn that. Uh, but uh, as the brother said, God is not anti-science. We should pursue knowledge. We should understand the earth that God has created. And as we understand the world around us, it helps us understand God on a deeper level. Science can be very beneficiary. And um, I know a uh, doctor friend who is spirit-filled and loves the Lord, mm -hmm. and God has used him powerfully. And uh, when he was seven years old, the Lord said, you're going to serve me as a physician. And so, you know, it's not just that we're up here as preachers serving the Lord. God has a place for everyone to serve him, and even in the scientific world, if it's for the glory of God. Hey, everyone. Hope you enjoyed the video. To see more like this, be sure to hit the subscribe button below. Get all the latest content from TCT Ministries. We'd love to pray alongside you for God's blessings in your life. So you can email your prayer requests to prayer at tct.tv or click the link below and submit your request at tct.tv. God bless you and thank you for watching.